Well, welcome back, everybody who's on, excuse me, on YouTube and on Twitch. Welcome. Let's go back to what we were doing. Let's go to the board. We're recruiting for closing in See what is available now. So is this a frog quest? <laughs> Didn't think you'd still be hanging around. Well, since you clearly don't have anything better to do, think I could put you to work? The remainder of your bounty. I need it delivered to someone. Hmm. I've already got a porter picked out too. This here is Salmon. Since he'll be the one making the drop, it's your job to get him there safe. Huh. Doesn't seem like too much of a hassle, but who exactly is this money for? My son. Haven't seen him in a spell. Not since he left town. I never looked back. This gills me washing my hands of him. He's a grown man. Can't be clinging to his mom's skirts. Or her pocketbook. The crow's nest. Boy got sick of living under this steel sky. And my thumb, I suppose. So he went into the mountains way east of here. Found some more like-minded idiots. Kinda sad, if I'm being honest. If you're gonna run away, at least go somewhere interesting. Don't half-ass it. I meant what I said. Can't afford to take care of this town and his shit. I raised him best I could. Gave him every advantage. But he's gotta learn to stand on his own two feet. Besides, I've got someone else to take care of now. Don't I, Sam? Oh. Let's go ahead and finish Much this obliged. up. Once you make it to the crow's nest, find Toby. He'll make sure you get the reward I promised. But if I find a single hair out of place on Sam, you won't live to enjoy it. You keep this my music's voice dope. safe. Okay. I guess we gotta like follow him. What was that about? Just leave it right there. Yes, sir. Oil. Oh, it's in Priscilla. Back in the day. Wow. We haven't played with this party in a while, so I'm kind of glad to get back with the original core group. Oh, this one. Just gotta run out of here. Hey, buddy. Sure. Don't you worry. Any monster that wants to get you is gonna have to go through me. We've got an escort quest. One of the very first, first few ones that we have like this. Hey, Cloud, remind me. How old were you when you left home? 14. Wait, it was spring, so 13. Suppose that ain't too unusual for small town boys like you. What'd your mom have to say? Not much. Who try to stop me? Like you said, nothing unusual about it. But. But. 2,000 gil. 
and she offered me that to make a fresh start. <laughs> Guess moms are the same all over. I turned the money down though. Didn't need it since I was planning to enlist straight away. <laughs> but you still can't help setting your price to two grand. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I wonder if we're gonna have to like literally go all the way to the very end of the map. Yeah, his name is Salmon, yeah. <laughs> to grab all these items while we're running here. Fight music is like wild. <laughs> bow wow wow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> wow. Okay, hear me out. What? Go out, some parents stop the kids from leaving the nest, claiming it's too soon or they're not ready. Any excuse to keep them at home. <laughs> what about it? Loads of parents are like that, but I told myself I'd be different. I'd never keep my little girl from flying. I don't want to clip her wings. I want her to soar. <laughs> I hear you scoffing. You think I can't do it? You think I'll keep her all to myself? Oh, yeah. And that's what scares me. As much as I want to let her fly, I don't know if I'll be able to let go when the time comes. Maybe I'll panic, get in the way, hold it down, all to keep her safe. Oh, Marley. <laughs> I wish you could be my baby girl forever. God, the soundtrack is amazing. And this isn't even in the original game. This is like completely new content. Soundtrack is already 10 out of 10. Don't overdo it. 
Wow, this dog is gonna take us all the way to the other side. I'm very curious to see like when we get to the end. Oh, my sweet baby girl. What now? Your daddy. Your silly daddy. He's gonna, Sorry. He's gonna <laughs> I'm very curious you. to see like oh, how everything's gonna look like when I get side. Barrett, get your shit together. Marlene's barely out of diapers. You've got time. Right, right. I'm just getting worked up over nothing. Yeah, she won't be leaving me for a while. Then again. Hey! <laughs> Man, Cloud. <laughs> oh, enemies. New type of enemy. Oh, I've been petrified. Um, I think that's the amount of damage all in the state will turn you to stone. Ready and incapacitated. Avoid damage until the status wears off. Or cure the ailment with the sauna remedies or the spells. Or items with similar effects. <laughs> Way to go, Tifa. Way to go, Tifa. Oof. Okay, where are you? Hopefully we can find a bench real soon. Rara sounds my best friend when she starts catastrophic Catastrophing about her son going to college. Last time I was literally like, dude, he literally just puked all over you and on the couch. You have plenty of time. He turns two in a row. <laughs> That's a good story. <laughs> a 
least now I know about Petrify. Petrify, that's a... It's gonna be a very interesting um, status element to avoid. Sam! What are you doing here? <laughs> Came all this way and you're still full of energy. Uh, do I know you? We're Sam's bodyguards. Your mom hired us to keep him safe. And to make sure her boy got his allowance. Keep it. I ain't taking her money. I can make ends meet on my own. Who are they, Dylan? Friends of yours? Claire! What are you doing out of bed? You know you need to stay off your feet. I know you came all this way, but I can't accept that. Just make sure Sam gets home safe for me. You really are your mother's kid. Got her stubbornness and everything. Have it your way. Uh, Why don't you hang on to it? This is a fortune. If you really don't want it, I'll take it off your hands. But as a parent, I'm sure you want to give your kid the best life you can. And in my experience, that don't come cheap. Think it over. <laughs> That's true. We'll take it. Dilster was looking for you, dude. Well, the animation on the Toby. animals in, in Sorry, um, like got a little side animals up. are, are done very well Aren't and a lot better than last Avalanche? time. Ronda said I might run into you. Avalanche? Oh, we got a. You mean they're the ones who blew up those reactors? The superstars. We got a themselves. manual, nice. I just want to say it is such an honor to meet you. Actually, while you're here, think I could ask you for a favor? Seeing as Dylan's uh, situation seems to be taken care of? Yep, it's all good. Excellent. In that case, why don't we step into my office for a chat? Right this way. Nice. More new quests are available. Oh, have, oh, they have their own board over here. Got it. Michaela, that's the champion that we gotta we have to take down. Oh yeah, that's right. Okay, cool. Man, human Carinos are so This will be else. when I saw you on the news, I was blown away. This will be a good section. This is gonna be a good one, guys. And here you are, lending me a hand. It's literally a dream come true. So here's the situation. There's this big lighthouse down by the Cape, and okay. someone calling themselves the Merc of Junon has turned it into their hideout or something. Curie. Oh, are they an acquaintance of yours? Sorta. What are the chances? I don't know about you, but I think fate brought us together. Anyway, that place has got a killer view. We used to go up there all the time and just chill. But it's too dangerous with all the monsters around, and that merc hasn't done a thing about him. So I was hoping you could do me a solid and convince that merc to help us out. Um, yeah, sure. They've done many a good deed in Midgar and all throughout the grasslands. Allegedly, that is. And like, if they're so good at doing good, then why aren't they doing anything now? The, the lighthouse is up ahead, right on the cape. Apparently, it used to guide ships back in the Republic days, but that was like forever ago. Anyway, it's super out of the way and crawling with monsters. Anyone who thinks customers will come calling is out of their mind. Eh, that was all. Yo, you're the best. You know, I just knew I could count on you. <sighs> so. You gonna help or me? You can sniff out trouble. <laughs> I suppose that does make me the most suitable candidate. Oh, pro tip. If you ever get the chance, you ought to swing by the hill too. 
You might even catch a glimpse of the Great Condor if you're lucky. If you're into that kind of stuff. Okay. So Red's gonna be the main person in this party. Maybe we should add him. There you go. I get that we're brand new to but this before series. we go ahead and do that, there's a lot of icons to click around here. Oh. Let's do... Cool stuff. Let's item transmute um, planet's favor. Like the rallies. I didn't sign up to carry stuff paper around you Then you join the wrong people. Maybe Where's the best spot to put up a post? La 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 Curious about this old clavier? I'm Dorian, representative of the Piano Outreach Association. Yay, piano it is mini game. my duty to support those who liberate music from the page and bring it to life with their performances. Obtain sheet music found at pianos around the world to add these scores to your repertoire. To achieve an A rank in a performance, speak with Dorian and he'll reward you for your musical product uh, for your musical prodigy. I hope you okay. will aid me in my humble mission to spread the joy of Good, the piano to getting S rank is so tough. <laughs> Would you getting care a star to share a performance with me? Sure. Um, yeah. Of course, the path to which is why I ask your continued assistance in sharing the joy of music with the world. Okay. What about if I go here? And now I play the piano. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna try this, guys. Hopefully, we can get an A. I, I, I've gotten some practice in this, so. We'll see how it is the first time you play it. Yeah, we know how to do this. Um, there we go. Let's try this out and see what we can do. Should have got an A, definitely. I'm pretty sure we got an A. I hope so. I hope to God we did. Not too bad. Not too bad our first time. Yeah, let's quit. I've been practicing falling up. I, I played the Tifa theme so many goddamn times before this. It is so hard. So, so hard. There's no finer sound in all the world than the voice of a humble piano. 
mellifluous melodies are all the more pleasing when played Hell on yeah. the piano. Thank you for sharing such joy with the world. I hope you will enchant us with even more splendid performances in time. <laughs> I practiced like for like almost two hours and I still couldn't get an S rank on that. So like when I when I did a bit of research and found out the there's a trophy for doing all of them. But you only have to get an A. So I was like, oh, thank God. Did it make it like stupid hard? And the only way you can get a, um, an, a star rank is if you get like a perfect. So I'm so glad they, they didn't make it like too hard to do. Um, there's a community board here. There's so much to do now. Um, I mean, we could beat some people at Queen's Blood so we can get, like, their cards. Actually, now that I have this area, can we go back? There is a guy, there is a card collector guy we could go to. Um, let's do a, a quick little travel to him. We gotta go to the ranch, though, so we can catch the carriage. And then we can go over to the other side. We can go back to the grasslands, basically. So, need a lift somewhere? Yeah, we're going back to Bill's Ranch. I felt so happy that, like, even if I, even when I messed up, I still was able to get an A easily. <laughs> oh man, tried so hard. <laughs> <laughs> super, super hard to get that. Uh, windmill settlement. Oh, there it is. Okay, we're not going to burst him, but we are going to buy cars now. So, what can I do for you today? Um, can I purchase cars? Yeah, we got new cards to get. Sweet. Bear decks now. Leave. Thank you for your patronage. No worries. Thank you for selling me more cards and play more Queen's Blood. <laughs> Because it is, it actually is kind of fun. Spare your legs and catch a ride. Yes, we don't want to. We don't want to run all the way down there, and that's like at least an hour's worth of, maybe twenty minutes worth of time just running there. Okay, sweet. Now we can go this way. Yeah. So glad we did all the other stuff, man. So glad we did all the other stuff before we can do this. We are gonna reclaim these waters and make them beautiful. A fisherman's only child with pops and I. You with an agency? Here to sign me? No oh, wait. You came out here just to see the famous Queen's Blood rocker. All right, twist my arm, why don't you? I'll give you the show of a lifetime. I'm good. Oof! Savage! So you're not a talent scout or a fan. Why didn't you say something? The name's Neil. And I'm gonna be the world's greatest QB playing guitarist. What do you say? Wanna play against a future celebrity? Let's see. Okay. Um, sure. Probably gonna lose. Oh, let's see, when destroyed, lowered the power of the allies. So he does like tons of debuffing. We need to go into like maybe a deck that is just destroys decks. So we still need to advance. Um, ooh, this one's really good. I like this one.
When destroyed, it raises the power of the ally cards on affected tiles by five. Let's try this. Oh gosh, really bad. I don't want any of those. I gotta restart. <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to play anything after that. <laughs> okay, let's try it one more time. <laughs> that was bad. I need I need things that can help me advance to the board. Um, this, this, and this.
Let's see what you're gonna do. Got him. I like Queen's God Blood. Damn, it's a lot of fun. You legit wiped the floor with me. Then again, I can count on one hand the times I've won. I might actually not be cut out for this. <gasps> Hear that? An upbeat melody's coming to me, clear as day. That's it. I could feel my spirits rising. I knew I was a musical genius. That loss was just what I needed to get my groove back. Oh, I can tell this one's gonna be good. One of these days, I'll make it to the big time, give my folks the life they deserve. Until then, there's nothing for it but to keep strumming guitar and playing cards. Nice. Oh, he's actually playing the guitar from there. Sick. Okay, so the other Queen's Blood player is over here. Let's go into our folios and go into Barrett. He really seriously needs to get these. United Focus. Sure. Applies a protect status um, into combat. Let's do that. This is red. Um, Max MP up, that's all right. I think this is the better one. Find up SP for that. This is Aerith. Spellbound Blast. Oh, 
reduces 5% damage while guarding. Uh, damage dealt with basic attacks. I mean, I guess... What was this? Sure. Synergy ability. Yeah. We need to unlock more abilities. Let's go and get to wherever this guy is. Hello there, everyone. I'm Michaela, a member of Crows Against Shinra. I want to tell you how we can. Hello. My name's Michaela. And I'm a proud member of the CAS's Queen's Blood Promotion Committee. Our goal is to spread awareness about the game's diplomatic potential. We believe it's our best shot at getting Shinra to agree to negotiations with us. What do you say? Wanna play and help me drum up interest? Sure. I like this deck. It served me well last time, so... Um, oh, God, God, get rid of this one. That's awful. That's awful. Yeah. She uses a lot of ones. Got it. Okay. Let's see what you got on your last card.
Still beat ya. Easy peasy. Got the Mind Flare card. Nice. That was great. See what I'm talking about? That connection you feel when you're playing someone. You, my friend, are now officially a member of the Queen's Blood Promotion Committee. People laugh, but I really think this game has the power to bring folks together in a way few things can. Because the key to world peace isn't violence. It's joy. Plain and simple joy. Comrade, I hereby ask you to go forth and play Queen's Blood. Spread the joy of gaming. I'm counting on you. Hell yes. Oh, believe me, playing Queen's Blood is a joy. I'll say it time and time again. I never thought I would like this mini, uh, this mini game they have, but it's super fun. Look at our ocean. Look at it. What do you see? I'll tell you what you see. The green gate of Shinra's point. Oh, it's underneath here. Who's now. worth a damn? I'm Cameron, Queen's Blood champion, and I roam the world in search of proper sport. I've scaled mountains, braved wastelands. As I communed with nature, I received a vision, the true spirit of this game we both play. And now I shall reveal it to you. Are you prepared? Then come. Sure. Midgar Somer is a level six. When allied and enemy cards are destroyed, raise the card's power by one. Oh, that sucks. That's going to be a very interesting one to deal with. Um, these are pretty good, actually. Okay. Let's see what this guy does. Okay. This is like a lot of riot, uh, riot pieces.
gonna it's gonna be a loss. A very aggressive, aggressive, aggressive deck. So. Any things to advance the board forward? kind of cool that you can get like a pre-made deck.
I might need more like singles. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Now what are you gonna do? Nothing, right? Nothing. You are locked into this now. And I'm just gonna bully you all the way through. Awesome. Hey. The hell? This is wrong. This is all wrong. I don't understand. It was just supposed to be a game. No. There it is again. That voice. Could it be? Has returned. No, that's impossible. It's just a silly card game. Truth about Queen's blood. The hell? You okay? Were you granted a transcendent vision, as I too was? You look as though you've just seen a ghost. Saying that, I'm reminded of the story of Lidrell Balmon, the creator of Queen's blood. After he started selling cards, he spoke of hearing a strange voice. He then withdrew from the public eye and became a recluse. No one saw him again until his death. There's no shortage of people who've had their lives turned upside down by the cards. Just goes to show what a deep and captivating game it is. Indeed, this match of ours stands as proof of that truth. Thank you for this experience.
Well, we finished that. Now... Where were we? Um, I think we were looking at the board, probably. Supposed to, supposed to look at the community board. The hardest sell. Oh, the lighthouse. That's right. be an understatement. Curious. Oh, it's the other way. This way. Poured their energy into the promotional aspect. They'll be thrilled to hear it. Let's go. Oh. What is Kyrie up to this time? Thinking I had a customer. Well, thanks for making the trip out here to say hi, fellow Merc. Not your fellow anything. And quit calling yourself a Merc. You're giving the real ones a bad name. Uh, what if it is a Merc? Nobody really knows. And besides, arguably this whole mess can be laid at your feet, mister. <sighs> I came all the way out to Junon to strike it rich, but nobody knows we're here. Or even that we exist. Zero publicity, which means zero clients. I mean, this is business 101. Ugh. Since you suck so bad at self-promotion, I had to pick up the slack and come up with an ad campaign. But like... What's your brand? Tall, blonde, and not interested. <laughs> Sounds like a one-way ticket to bankruptcy to me. <laughs> Allergies. What? Shut up. This thing can talk? Indeed. Aww! Aren't you just the most adorable boy? Hey, you know, I've always wanted a pet of my own. Come here, come to mama. 
For us, yet we haven't managed to bring in a single customer. And if we don't get one really soon, your CEO and PR head is as good as done! But not to worry! I put my creative skills to work and came up with this ditty. <laughs> Pretty good, right? Folks will be lining up in no time. Monsters? Well, who could have drawn them here? I'm sure your aggressive advertising has <laughs> nothing to do with it. Please, Cloud, you've got to help me! After all, nobody knows how to take down monsters like a merc. So hire yourself. You're a pro, aren't you? Come on, don't be petty. Oh, I'll even give you some of these. Uh, pass. <laughs> Wait, our lives are in as much danger as hers now. We have to fight. Alrighty. Fine. Fine. Let me steal all your items first, though. Oh, we have it with red. Got it. You got this. Leave it to me. Let's do Stardust. Stars to your room. It's on you. Follow me. Not enough. 
Let's go. Oh, let's try it. Let's try this one. Nice. Take over. Take it from here. Great. She is good as dead. Oh, <laughs> this is the easy pickin' for a merc like you. Oh. 
Oh, they have like they have like specific elements. Got it. Bad. And now I know why I wasn't getting any customers. Nobody could get past all those uglies. I'm glad you learned something. Oh well. Guess I'll just have to close up shop and clear out. Anyway, I'm gonna split, but I'm sure you can take it from here. Catch you later, fellow Merc. Hey. Wanna leave with Mama? Come on, you know you do. I wouldn't wish her on my worst enemy. You and me both. My dudes! I saw the monsters headed your way. I couldn't help but worry. But it looks like I worried for nothing. I should have known Avalanche could hold their own. Out of curiosity, what happened to that Merc? She moved on. Bummer. Well, guess we should get this place cleaned up. Oh yeah! Rondo was telling me you do Merc work on the side, too. For real? I can't believe you didn't say anything! Best buds don't keep secrets, you know. But I hope you'll lend me a hand the next time I need help. I'm very curious, like, what my... what the, the Merc outfit looks like. Oh, okay. That was that was that was super fun. <laughs> oh, is this the toad one? Yeah. Okay. Um. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, let's use the chocobo for that. <laughs> I'm very curious about the outfit we get for that. Oh. I'll pet you for just a second. What? No. So we know how to get here.
crow's nest. Feel free to run. <laughs> Let me guess. Looking to join up. young lady. We've got a lovely breeze blowing today. You certainly do. So, what are you all looking at? We're on the lookout for the Great Condor. We try to catch sight of it every time it takes flight. Make sure it's in good health and all that. It's not really a danger to people, but its hunger can drive it to hunt larger prey. Let's just hope it never develops a taste for us. Surely you've seen our newsletter, haven't you? It's filled with fun facts about our beloved bird. I'm quite proud of it. Sir, I don't think the condor is going to show today. Maybe we should head back. No, let's wait a little longer, lad. That bird's got me a bit worried. Haven't seen it in a fair while now. I wonder if we should have given it something to eat after all. Perhaps. I put a post up on the notice board asking for help, but, uh... Well, if you're still looking for volunteers, we'd be more than happy to help. Well, far be it for me to turn down such an offer. It's a grand old bird. Makes its nest in a small island just a stone's throw from here. Huh. You can save my life back when I was a lad, if you can believe it. The condor was looking out for me that day, so I thought I should start looking out for it. Keep tabs on its well-being and whatnot. It's a proud creature, a hunter at heart. We've tried to feed it before, but it seems to prefer catching its own prey. If something smelled enticing enough, though, it might be moved to come and take a closer look, I suspect. Back during the war, I was running from some Shinra troopers when one of them got me in the back. I fell to the ground. I thought I was done for, until that bird snatched me up and flew me to the next town over. <laughs> I sometimes wonder if it mistook me for its supper. I never managed to regain the use of my legs, unfortunately. But I feel my spirit soar when I watch that condor fly. I may be stuck here, but at least they're still free. Thank you. I appreciate it. One of the condor's favorite hunting spots is in the woods nearby. You'll need a chocobo that can manage the climb to get there. It's pretty tough.
in here. Let's go. That seems like such a weird one. I'm gonna try this. What about those? Better than nothing, right? That seems like such an odd one to pick. Out of the three.
Oh, you're back. Hope it wasn't too much trouble. You can put the food right over there. Thank you. Are those greens? Hmm. I can't say I've ever seen a feast on anything except me, but... It's worth a shot. I figure I picked something different. Gotta say, it's kinda nice. Looking up and seeing a blue sky. Beats a steel one, that's for sure. <laughs> Though at least with the steel sky you know your limits. Out here, it's endless. I kinda get what Aerith was saying now. Yeah, maybe. Hey, look! Hmm? <sighs> Let's see what the condor what does. Sight. I never dreamed I'd be able to see it up close like this. Oh. Oh. Wait, we have to get a photograph. Grab the camera. Yes, sir! Come on! Gather around, everyone! Quickly! Quickly! Say cheese! Oh. <laughs> what? I guess I picked, so, snap picked the right one. Shots? I hope so. It just showed up. I could barely hold my camera and... Really? Couldn't tell from a shot like this. Ah. I had to pick the one that I thought was <laughs> kind of odd. Well, I haven't looked this happy since I was a lad. It's precious moments like these that make condor watching so exhilarating. You never know what to expect. Well, scouts, let's finish writing up today's report and start preparing for our next fateful encounter. Sir! And hopefully next time we'll be able to snap a clear picture of that bird. Sir! Miss, I'd like you to have this. As a souvenir. <laughs> oh, we got warding material for that. That's pretty cool. Nice face, Cloud. I hope that we picked a good one. Go to the community board real quick. Rose against Shinra welcomes all the violence isn't the answer. I have a friend in Avalanche. If I You're gonna reclaim here. these waters and make them beautiful. We did both of them. Nice, 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 nice. Well, maybe this issue will get us more members. And you've got this one minute. Gotta see the frog master for the details on this one. Hope our relationships have deepened with Tifa.
Hey, what were you thinking sending Sam back alone like that? He even need us in the first place? Your mother'd give Stamp a run for his money. <laughs> so, how's my son? Seem okay? Yeah. You gonna stand there and pretend this wasn't all about Claire and her bun in the oven? <laughs> Apple didn't fall far from this stubborn ass tree. That's for damn sure. <laughs> Wouldn't know about that. And if you're done making wisecracks, I got work to do. See the frog master. Elevator's been shut down. So we should have never let them build a reactor in our waters. I don't know if it's because of the reactor out there or what, but hanging out here turns you into a frog. Hey, Finn, who are they? Not Shinra, I hope. Oh, no, we're definitely not. Oh, wait. You must be the ones Priscilla was talking about. She told me how you saved her. Right, that's us. We're friends. Are you a friend of hers, too? We're friends, but it's not like I like her or anything. It's just, there aren't a lot of other kids in the village, so I basically had to be your friend. <laughs> of course. So what are you kids doing all the way down here? Uh, playing Jump Frog, obviously. Actually, we could use a couple more players. Since you're here, do you want to give it a try? <laughs> Help us! <laughs> Come on, Cloud. Ribbit? Oh I tried gosh. to warn you! Like I said, hanging out here turns you into a frog! But don't worry, <laughs> all you gotta do is start thinking like a frog, and you'll be fine! Oh. Ribbit! Ribbit! Okay. Ribbit! Flash out was unavailable.
almost died. Jeez. Thanks for that. So, ready to play? Come on, I love it. I promise. Ribbit? Ribbit. <laughs> okay, here are the rules. Flip over upcoming obstacles and dash to safety with either R2 or L or L3. Remain the platform as long as you can to prove your MPV and finesse. Get knocked off and you'll croak. Think you two can handle it? Um Okay. We gotta try and see them. always become bad at games when they get older or something. So, do you wanna go another round? Yeah, sure. Our goal is a minute and 20 seconds. Okay. Like, master this. Pretty close.
free gear, so... Damn, 120 seconds. Oh gosh. It looks like I was like 115. So there is like a certain pattern that you gotta do. What if I can go this way? I'm just trying things out. I think getting like two and feeble rings is fine for now. We don't get like an achievement for getting this, so... Oh, wait, I didn't, I didn't actually want to do this, but okay. I was trying to get out. <laughs>
So it looks like we completed everything. But the crow's nest folks don't try anything stupid. Or we go to our marker. That's here. where we're gonna be in. Let's go to a cushion real quick. You wouldn't believe how quiet these waters used to be. Okay, where was I? Or a bench. Let's go to a bench. All right. So for everything that we've done, I think this is a good shot because as soon as we start walking into that area, it's gonna take us into the next, the next section. So I think this is where we're gonna be ending it, guys. So thank you guys once again so much for watching. We'll be back. And um, hopefully we'll find a way to get up to the topper level, the upper level of Junon. So we'll see you guys all next time. You guys take care and peace out. Everyone did what well, uh, is doing well. Hope you guys are enjoying the playthrough. We'll see you guys all next time. You guys take care. Uh, we'll be back hopefully maybe tomorrow with more um, with more of Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. And yeah, um, probably gonna be a longer stream for tomorrow. So we'll see how it goes. Anyways, take care. Peace out. <laughs>